Good morning. What do you have on your hands? Gloves. Gloves? Are you eating with gloves on your hand? Hearts. Hearts? Where's hearts? <gasps> There's a heart on your shirt. A. Is there an A? I don't see an A on there. What? Where did you get those things for your hands? A. Oh, does it look like an A from upside down? It's an M. 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 Hey, what's on your hands? Good morning. She woke up this morning and had taken her socks off in bed and put them on her hands and doesn't want to take them off. <laughs> I told her I didn't think she'd be able to eat with them, but... Us. Yeah, you took them off your feet. That's right. Can you eat with those gloves on? Let me see. Let me see you eat some pancakes with your gloves. <laughs> you are so silly. <laughs> Not sure it's the most sanitary thing, but oh well, you know, whatever. Yes, I. <laughs> You're so silly. Back at it again with the paint. Yeah. Did you get paint on your hand? We came and got some paint. We made a decision on a color. So I will show you guys which one it is when we get home. Some boxes to keep all the stuff in as we're unloading the room. Yeah, it's wet. What happens if you touch it? Ew, it's on your finger. Does anybody else have a kid who has to get out of the house in the morning? Like the days, like today when we were just trying to get stuff done around the house, if we're at home and Gaines is not like getting out or going somewhere, she gets so crazy. Like she, I mean, for her, you know, she gets whiny and irritable and she's, I think she's just bored. She's like, what are we doing here? Can we go do something? So we were trying to get stuff ready for the nursery this morning. Luckily, I needed to go get the paint still, so I was able to take her with me and get out. But it's one of those things every morning, I'm like, where can we go? Like, even if it's just to the store, like just to walk around or something. Like, she just does not like being in the house in the morning, which is hard when you work from home and you're like, okay, I've gotta get some things done before lunch, blah, blah, blah. She's eating two chicken nuggets, you guys. This is monumental. Yeah. I think her uh, vegetarian, what is it? Is it yeah, vegetarian? vegetarian? Her vegetarian days are over. Well, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> Look at you, you just jinxed it. She's never gonna eat one again. Show daddy how you can take a big She's bite. She's gotten a lot better though. Show me a big bite. Show how you can eat Poke a it. big bite. With your fork like a big girl. Say bye on the phone. You gotta tell whoever you're talking to. Bye. <laughs> okay, there you go. Now show daddy how you can get that like a big girl with your fork. There she goes. Let me see. I don't think you can do it. Show me. Stab it. Uh oh. Stab it with your fork. Uh -oh. <laughs> Get that one. This is a new challenge. Chicken nugget challenge. You Stab have it. With, <laughs> no hands. <laughs> no hands challenge. Here, get it. Get it. Push hard. Push hard. Push hard. Push hard. <laughs> you didn't push hard. Don't push like your poopy out. There you go. Now push hard. There you go. Good job. Oh, you forgot your dippy. Dippy. Yummy. <laughs> Yay. Look out. 
Oh, I'm turning into a chicken. Baguette! Oh, oh my goodness, baguette! <laughs> Good Not job. that chicken nuggets are the healthiest option, but when your kid never eats any meat, um, yeah, it's I'm, I don't care. You know? This is awesome. <laughs> I always didn't get them, but then I was like, well, let's just try, because she didn't eat one at Good job. Oh, you've been introduced to dipping your fries in the Frosty. What you think about that? <laughs> you like it? We're having a real healthy food day today. Sometimes when it's Saturday and you're working around the house, you just gotta get some Wendy's. What do you think about that? Is it yummy? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Who else dips your fries in the Frosty? If you haven't, try it, it's good. One trip to the donation center done. Just dropped off that big desk. And now I'm headed back. I'm gonna get an armoire and uh, take it over to Grand Alley's. And then I'm going to get the crib and maybe dresser. I don't know yet. I'm just gonna see how big they are and see if I can handle it by myself. We've just got a busy week next week, so now's the time. <laughs> Dang, this would have been a dope spot for the music video. If we'd have done it in like a back alley, back here, getting the crib. Get, he's gone up to get it. I guess it's upstairs. He just took an elevator, like an uh, old, Took an elevator up in that thing and was going to get it and bring it back down. Crazy. It's so weird down here in this alley. There it is. Crib and dresser. Woo! I think I can manage it. I think I can get it. And then I still got to put together a coffee table and a side table for the back deck again. A lot of y'all were asking where we got the uh, little storage bin for the back deck and Everything we got was from Target as far as all the storage stuff goes and the coffee table and stuff you'll see probably, hopefully, sometime soon, if not today <laughs> and, or tomorrow and in the upcoming vlogs. Whoa, what'd Daddy bring home? Whew. Who's this furniture for? Is this baby brother's crib and dresser? We got the dresser. Baby. We got the crib. It's got to be put together. Yeah. And Cullen just brought all this up. The stairs into the house by himself. Over my shoulder. <laughs> he did not. But he has been moving so much furniture today. Like and I am so thankful that you were able to do it because. We got lots of We got busy weeks coming. Yes. And obviously, I couldn't have carried anything up. But it was saved us some money because the company that we ordered it from or the place we ordered it from, they don't actually deliver themselves, but they have you referred to like a moving company. So we would have had to pay a moving company to come well, do it. Tell them when they'd be free to. True. Enter. You know, like yes. if they can go move somebody's house and get paid for that, or they can come put together somebody's crib, they're probably going to pick the house. Yes, up. exactly. And we did have Gaines crib and dresser and stuff delivered and put together. But I think we but did that. Hers, we planned all that. Yeah, we planned it ahead of time, and hers was bigger, I feel like. Okay, so I told you guys I'd tell y'all about the paint colors, and of course they look a little bit different on the camera. This one is Lunar Surface, and that one, I don't even remember. It was the first one that I showed y'all in the first video. You gonna rock? <laughs> so, somebody commented on a video and said Passive Gray. I think her name was Laura or Lauren, I don't remember. And I looked it up and I was like, oh, I love that color. Okay, so then these two were colors that we used in Gaines Room, or that we got to sample for Gaines Room. This one is called Anonymous, and this one is called Sparrow, or this one's called Sparrow, and this one's called Anonymous. And I really thought I liked Passive Gray, but then once I started looking at the other ones, I thought, I think that's just gonna be too light. And it kind of has a purpley blue glow. Like if you look at it over here, it's this one. I don't know, it doesn't look as much on the camera like it does, but in real life it does. And I liked the tones better in the lunar surface. So what I did was I got lunar surface and I got it lightened by 25%. So it'll just be a little bit lighter. Cause this is Gaines Room color and it's dark, but it doesn't really look that dark, but we're gonna have dark furniture in here. The furniture is gonna be darker than hers. So if you look at her room, her gray is, it doesn't look as dark on the video as it really is, but her furniture is also lighter. So I felt like 
a lighter gray would be better to make the furniture stand out more. I don't know. And I didn't want them to be like exactly the same, but it'll be pretty similar. So it's funny though that that lunar surface we picked out originally is so similar to the color in her room. It's just a little bit lighter and a little bit less on the purpley side. So there's our paint colors. If you're looking for a gray, there's some options for you. Now up the second flight of stairs. I hate stairs. I wish you had somebody to help you. Whoa. Woo, he got it in here. This is the paint that was lightened 25% from that one. And you can definitely tell a difference. Not a huge difference. If I had it to do over, I would have lightened it 50% instead of just 25. But here it is over here too. I feel like you really can't even tell the difference at all there. Because that's the lightened one. That's the original. But I, I do still like the color. And I think it will look good. Careful. Oh gosh, here comes the crib. At least that one's not as big and bulky. It's still heavy though. <sighs> Woohoo! Yay, they're in! Now I gotta put them together. You did it. But still, that was the hardest like manual labor part, at least. I hope we like them. What if we have to take them back? <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, there's something fun for you. That house is just your size. Who's there? <laughs> Dogs bark. Daddy made you a sunroof in there. <laughs> hey look, here's a crayon. You can draw in that house. Draw on your walls, in the house only. Draw in that, draw in the box. Yeah. Hold the crayon better so you can do it easier. All right, this is the five drawer chest. Chest of drawers. Chest of drawers dresser that we got in the color. This is gonna be the same color as the crib, obviously. We'll show that whenever we do like the nursery reveal or something because I gotta put it together. But here it is. So bum it's bum slate bum. Gray. Slate gray. Which is a color we didn't even think of. We were like, oh, if we don't do gray or brown, we're gonna have to do black. And hers is like really, really light. So you see the difference? It's a lot lighter. But that is going to be the room color with the slate gray. Yes, I definitely like that choice of color now that I see it with the furniture too. Totally. And we're going to have accents like this with a little other little surprises. You'll just have to wait and see. This may be one of the last times you see the nursery yeah, until we think reveal so. it. I think so. Cause we gotta... Fingers crossed that we get it revealed before he comes. <laughs> Hopefully so. Leave a comment below. Let us know if you like it. Let us know if all you think the crib needs and to go It doesn't really with. matter because <laughs> this is what we're going with. But. <laughs> well, we made it out to the back deck. Got this and this put together. That's going to store yeah. some towels and such. And this will store something It's all opens up in its storage. And then it's over there. And I talked about it earlier where we got it and stuff. Yeah. We got the tiki torches burning, keeping the skeeters away. Skeeter ain't skeeter. Well, first, skeeter needs to get properly sanctioned for the event. Okay, here we go, skeeter. Let's just get a hell over here. We got a little, we got a little curd bucket in here. It's gonna be like a little hot chocolate tamale. <laughs> all right, here goes skeeter. Skeeter ain't skeeter. What's in your mouth? No, no. A yeah. noodle? What else? What was mommy looking at a minute ago? Did you get a new tooth down there? No. Yes, you did. <laughs> She's been so irritable today and we were like, what is wrong with her? <laughs> and then I was looking at it in her mouth and she's got one of her, she's always just had these front two bottom teeth. Now you got and now she's got one next in. to it that came yeah. in and then this one that's yeah. working on coming in. Yeah. Clouds. clouds. That's, That's right. right. There's clouds all in the sky. So she's probably going to have more than just her bottom two teeth. She can like really eat a sandwich. Oh my gosh. She saw that Boom. airplane. <laughs> you just tripped on yourself trying to see the airplane. How did she see that? Right, there it is. Like, I don't even know if y'all can see it. It is way up there. Is that an airplane? Big airplane. Oh my you goodness. Saw it. We're going to go chill on the back deck and enjoy the rest of the evening. I might go get something to grill out. By chill, you mean you're about to have to edit and everything else. It never Your stops. work never ends. Thank it's you been a so busy, much busy day. for everything you've done today. Seriously. No problem. I feel so helpless because I can't help you with anything. Well, you don't need to be. You've been lifting a million things. <sighs> It's crazy. We got a lot done today though. So stay tuned for the rest of the week and okay. tomorrow is Sunday there fun day and we will see why O T F S. Bye. Catch, Catch you on, on the, the flip, flip side. side. Bye. Peace. Pigtail. Pigtail. Ponytail. Peace. This out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it actually works. <laughs>
Touched it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay.